Well, you have to remember that we are dealing with a virus to which no person on the planet has prior immunity unless they have faced the disease. So you have two options. One is you put your population into nearly constant repeated lockdowns until a vaccine arrives. And some countries may choose to do that. Some others might say that, well, I'm not going to put my country in lockdown. I'm going to keep it under control. But of course, the disease is going to continue to spread. And my objective is just to keep it under control so it doesn't overwhelm my health systems. But in the process, I get to herd immunity. There are only these two options. There is no other third option. The option of making the disease go away doesn't exist. My guess is that at this rate, by the end of the year, we will have achieved herd immunity. This is not a target to set and go after it. It is just that it's hard in a country like India to make infections go away. And when infections don't go away, it just means that it continues to spread. Well, the Indian government is basically saying that we obviously can't afford to have hard lockdowns forever and forever. And if you don't have a hard lockdown, by default, you are going into a world where you will reach herd immunity. I think this is going to be true everywhere in the world. I don't think any country is different here with respect to COVID. I think there's going to be a lot of asymptomatics that already are. And our estimate is that about 75 to 80 percent of people who have the disease are have either mild or asymptomatic disease. And uh, they will continue to spread the disease, which is why any country that has seen cases go down uh, is only seeing a temporary reprieve. This is not a permanent reprieve because all the people with who are asymptomatic and carrying the virus are still out there. And the minute you ease the lockdowns, the disease will come back.